60s child. As you open your eyes to a new morning, you hear mum in the kitchen. Breakfast! Jam on toast for breakfast weren't too bad so long as it was... Hartley's new jam. But marmalade was a non-starter for me. <laughs> that, that, none of that racism. Shut up! The people on the TV tried their best to get us to eat eggs. The Egg Marketing Board's big promotion to encourage everyone to go to work on an egg are the egg chicks. They'll visit you at breakfast time and if you've got eggs on the menu, you get a premium bun. As for the Milk Marketing Board, they go to work on the chicks. Even though the ads were a bit strange. But it was those sugar-coated cereals we all craved. We're Snap, Crackle and Pop. They're great! There was plenty to choose from, but even more important was the backs of the packets had cut-out models you could build. The models were always easy to build, all you needed was scissors, a bit of sellotape or glue and away you went. And each cereal had their own themes. Shreddies gave us fighter planes. Sugar Spats gave us cut out models of Thunderbird puppets. And Weetabix gave us regiments of the British Army. and children of other lands. Kellogg's gave us animal heads to build. And dogs heads. They also produced this set, Heads of Fame. There was a peephole theatre from Sugar Puffs. Some had famous cartoon characters. And Disney films were always a winner. There was Heroes. and great moments in history. One of my favourites was this one, Armour Through the Ages, on the back of Kellogg packets. I used to volunteer to go with my mum shopping to the co-op stores, just so that I could choose the next figure on the box. Life was so much simpler those days. Yes, over the years the cereal makers certainly kept our scissors busy. Even in the 1970s, they were still going. Sixties kids like me would have had a lot of fun cutting out these cardboard models and building them. I wonder if today's kids would enjoy these. 
And if they did, would they be allowed to use the scissors like we did? No plastic round-ended scissors then. You got your mum's old scissors out the dryer and she shouted, you watch, you don't cut your fingers off with them. And that was your safety advice. So if you enjoyed this video and like to see more, click the bottom right hand corner where it says subscribe and I'll see you soon. Goodbye. Breakfast show!